I don't think we go into education looking for self-fulfillment. It's quite a collaborative role and it's a role that we do to give to others and to be of service to others. Since completing my Bachelor of Education Studies at ECU, I transitioned into a full-time classroom teaching role. And then throughout that time, I also realised that I would like to further my knowledge and understanding in education, and in particular Aboriginal education. So I enrolled in a Master of Aboriginal Studies, which was both a coursework and a research thesis course. And then I was able to fulfilled my role as a teacher, as a classroom teacher, as well as um, a business owner, an Aboriginal education consultant and uh, acting deputy principal. I was with Michaela on her very first day at university and when she came in she was obviously a young person who was eager to learn and that's what she did from that day on and she's got that wonderful insight to recognise an opportunity when it comes. She will see something simple and take it and make it something amazing and that's what she's done with her life. Halfway through my Bachelor of Education at Edith Cowan University I started my business Aboriginal Education Solutions and that was as a result of teachers needing professional learning outside of cultural awareness training. So what does it mean once you've attended a cultural awareness session, what does that mean in terms of how you consider pedagogy, how you consider curriculum, classroom leadership, student support and all of those things. So it's kind of sharing my knowledge with teachers in terms of how we can develop responsive practices of being in the classroom. When I was thinking about all of my external professional and personal roles within my community, I realised that all of them are teaching roles, funnily enough. They are um, leadership programs that I facilitate in my community, leadership programs that I've written for my community, um, reconciliation action plan communities um, with local government where I'm using my knowledge and skills to facilitate learning to a broad range of people. Michaela is a great representative of ECU because she has grasped what she's gained from us and she's taken it forward in ways of advocacy, not only for early childhood, but for Aboriginal people. I've had the honour of sharing the classroom with many Aboriginal students throughout my teaching career. And when I consider what my impact is uh, through children being able to see themselves represented as the teacher, but also in having their identities, languages and knowledges affirmed. I think that's really important. I feel really inspired by the children who see themselves in me because they walk 10 steps taller. I feel really proud to be a part of the ECU alumni community. I feel like we're a really strong collective of driven and motivated people. In particular, I feel really proud to be an alum of the School of Education at ECU because we have an incredible teacher education program and produce a range of high quality teachers. Your professional career starts at university. It's the networks you build, the opportunities you engage with, and the classrooms and children that you start to explore your practice with. This is where your professional career starts and it's where you can set a strong foundation for yourself.